Okay, number 142. Oh, wow. Um, boss got me a load for tomorrow, and I'm glad he did, because I am tired. Not too tired. Um, had a good day. Got a lot done. However, um, the boat. <laughs> all right, here we are. Um, I wanted to get all this cut off today so if i had tomorrow off i could sand i don't have tomorrow off however i don't have to be on a dock until late so i may still get some sanding done just not the whole thing and i'm okay with that but if i were off the whole day tomorrow all of this would get sanded tomorrow um but when i get back in we'll be in a little warmer temperatures and then it'll be all about sanding 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 and when that is done We'll move straight into uh, waterproofing and installing the bulkhead and getting the stringers made, waterproofed, installed, getting the transom water uh, finished installing. Uh, I mean, you know, we're, we're moving right along now. Um, the uh, multi-tool, the blades were dying on me, <coughs> and I decided... The smartest thing I could do if I wanted to get this done with the least amount of work is go invest in some more blades. So I went down and bought three new blades. They're $14 a piece. A little spendy, but they work good when they're new. And I uh, came back and put them in the multi-tool, and the multi-tool died. I mean, broke died. Like, uh... Well, this boat has eight one multi-tool and is on its second one. <laughs> but it works the doggone good. The, you, you know, I just had to have a new one, so I went down and bought a new one. Um, did not get the kit, just got the tool only, and am using the batteries I currently have. And when I got back, I realized I got another new bimetal Dewalt blade. So now I got four new blades and a new multi-tool. And... I zipped right around that thing. I was done in about 20 minutes. It was great. Um, but to avail, it will jump and move and slice and dice. And if your hand's in the way with the little rubber gloves, that won't stop it. <laughs> um, lucky for me, I had some Band-Aids and some, uh, I think they call it Ambisol. It's uh, a dyed uh, iodine. And it burns, but it's good stuff. It's better than peroxide. Um, so I doctored myself up, went right back to work, got the work done that I wanted to get done this trip. And tomorrow I don't have to be on the dock till 3, which means I've got time to take it easy this evening and get up there tomorrow and sand if I want to. Uh, but honestly, I've got nothing else to do but sand. And I'm, as far as I have to go on this trip right now, so I'll probably get up in the morning and do some sanding, but I'm going to cook supper here in a minute. Um, you know, phones can be frustrating. I don't know why, but I get, I've never entered into a group conversation with anyone um, intentionally. It doesn't mean that I don't get stuck there sometimes. It just means I didn't intend to send any message to anyone unless I was talking directly to that person. And I get a message from a number that I don't know. And um, it might be somebody from work on a cell number. I don't know. This is a work phone. Uh, but I don't do a lot of, I, I don't do any group messaging personally. Um, that being said, the message was uh, something to the effect that uh, they hope everyone gets arrested and blah, blah, blah. And I said, who is this? And when I said, who is this, that number went to a different number and i got a response back from that number starting a fight um who is this uh well i didn't text you are you sure you didn't text me here i'll send you a forward of all the texts you sent me which was what i just sent to this other number who was in a group that i don't know <laughs> So I deleted and blocked as best I could, and I shut the phone off, and I am moving forward. I have no idea who those people are. Don't know what their beef is. Don't care. None of my business. Um, but what I am going to do is uh, keep working on this boat. I'm going to take it easy tonight. I'm going to cook me up some dinner and uh, get ready to go out tomorrow. And uh, in the morning, I will probably get up and spend the morning sanding on the forward end i don't expect to get it all done 
but uh, I'm going to take it easy tonight. I mean, I feel good. I feel like I accomplished what I needed to accomplish, and uh, we're going to leave it at that. Thanks. Have a great day.